back in the day, so he made sure we were uh, hitting the gym, and uh, I can really credit him to that. So a lot of good, fond memories of Coach Oz. I'm happy you made it all the way down from Brainerd. So it's good to see uh, familiar faces and um, good talking with everyone. How about your season in uh, Florida right now, Nick? What's going on? Um, I mean, it's been a good season so far. We had a little bit of a slump, but uh, every team goes through those every once in a while. So we've got a good squad, good little mix of uh, veterans and younger guys. So. Um, we're, we're in the push right now, like I said, and these are really important points for us. So um, just being in it is a lot, a lot more fun when you're winning and uh, being a part of that. So um, good leadership qualities, good new coaches and everything. So it's, uh, it's a fun team to be a part of. Nick, uh, Hal says uh, you're a brutal softball player. Like, what do you got for him? Yeah, uh, yeah we're not, I'm not the best softball player, actually. Never played baseball. Um, never played baseball when I was younger. But, uh, yeah, I was probably my batting average is probably the lowest on the team this year, embarrassingly <laughs> enough. I can admit to that. So we got a lot of guys on that squad, a lot of former golfers that play in that softball team. It's a lot of fun. But so. f fun to see him again tonight in the eyes. You guys are just college roomies, etc. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, we like to give each other a hard time. We talk to each other quite a bit. So um, it's fun to play against him. He's a good player and it's a good team, like I said. So I know a lot of these guys. We skate with a lot of these guys in the summer. So kind of know what they bring to the table. Um, Fast team, skilled team, so it should be a good one. Your dad's in the stands. He tells me he not only watches the game, then he watches the tape the next day. He doesn't send you as much critique as he used to, but what, what kind of text does your dad pop to you now and then? Yeah, 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 he's been a big mentor. Uh, he's been a big part of my hockey career, um, obviously. And he helps me out a lot, watches the games intensely. Um, yeah, it, it's great having him. He, he gives me a lot of advice, and now I can kind of put the phone down if he's giving me a hard time. <laughs> I'm a little older now, so, but no, it's good. He doesn't really give me a hard time. And it's always usually positive, and um, yeah, I'm excited that he can watch tonight. Nick, what's been the key for your individual success this year? Um, playing with a lot of good players, it's um, it's a little different um, lineup for us. So definitely, guys are feeding me the puck, and we're finding ways to score. So it's a little different from that aspect. Um, last year was just kind of learning curve for me. So rookie year, didn't really know what to expect. Just trying to build some confidence, and I think that's a big deal. Confidence in this league, once you gain that, uh, starts rolling. So. Um, the, the biggest thing that's changed for me over the past year is probably confidence. Is that how you avoided the sophomore slump, as they call it? Like, Hoobie had a tough time, and you seem to, like, pick right up from last year. Yeah, I had a little bit of a yeah, sophomore early. slump there at the beginning of the yeah. season. Um, but, yeah, it's just how you handle it. You can't get too down on yourself. Um, just got to stay positive. So, yeah, you don't want to – there's so many games, you don't want to get too down on yourself if you play one bad game. So you just got to find ways to play in night in, night out. What do you expect tonight? A tense, both teams going for the same bone, uh, close to the playoff spot. Ferocious game tonight? Yeah, definitely. Obviously, the Wild are hot right now. A lot of good games they've played. Uh, I kind of keep track of them um, on Twitter a little bit. So, yeah, it's uh, it's fun to hear about them. And like I said, I, got, I know a lot of guys on this team. So, um, yeah, it's going to be a good battle, and it'll be a good competitive battle. We'll have to put the friendships aside for a couple hours, and then we can uh, chat a little bit after the game. Hopefully, we have the bragging rights. Has it or will it ever stop being a little weird coming out of this team? Yeah, um, yeah, it's, it's it's weird coming in the locker room as an opposing team, definitely. Um, being from Minnesota, but that's just how it goes. So, I mean, not many kids get the chance to play for their hometown team, so just getting the chance to play against them is uh, quite an honor. And I grew up 